Hey, what up? It's Jack Spade. And today we're going to be making some music for TV and film licensing. Let's get to it. Jack on the track like so it was crazy the way I got into TV film licensing. It was just on a whim, almost by accident. I was just on Craigslist and I seen somebody post that they was looking for music producers. So I responded and they, you know, I sent the music or whatever and um, he was digging my music and come to find out he made music for TV, him and his partner. And they had a company where they, that's all they did was just make music for TV and um, they made it for a lot of the reality shows. So they basically had the connections and what I would do is just send them music and they'll take a little piece. For some reason they stopped asking for tracks and that's cool with me, you know, um, things die down or whatever and things change in the industry and you know, connections change as well. So then I kind of strayed away from the music licensing a little bit, you know, to do some more video production which you know i have a video production company new wave content shameless plug but um i still wanted to do music licensing since i have a lot of music on tv already i feel confident that i can do this on my own so what i've learned is that when you're approaching music libraries you'll have a higher chance of them actually accepting your work if you have like more tracks so if you could come at them with like 10 to 15 tracks in the same genre then um, you'll have a higher chance of uh, getting accepted. So I'm working on a pack about 15 tracks, a pack about 15 tracks. It's your boy Jack trying to get them stacks. I can't help but rap. That was kind of corny. But you know what's not corny? Making money from your music. So that's what I'm gonna be doing right now is laying down a track for TV and film licensing. And I'm gonna show you how I get down when I'm trying to make that music pound on your TV in your town. See, I can't stop rapping. So without any further job jacking, let's get to the beat, baby. Yeah. All right, so I'm tapping it out. And really right here, I'm trying to find the melody. And that's the basic melody. Then I added those little notes on top. If you don't have half time, go ahead and get it, man. It's cheap. Adds another dimension to the melody. I love the way this looks on the uh, push. That's the channel EQ, really simple EQ. A lot of times that's all you really need. I love using splice. The Wonder Girl kit is just fire nothing but fire sounds then I added a few more drum sounds we can skip past all that then I added a few uh, native instrument sounds from the expansion packs I got with complete I won't talk too much over this part you pretty much see what's happening Actually gonna speed it up right here.
a little echo on the melody. I think this was a basic, uh, I forgot what that was, but that's a basic um, pad synth. Then I threw Shaper Box on that. Using this plugin is a good way to make a bland sound more exciting. And it's dope because it removes the need for automation sometimes. That's just a little ear candy. I wanted it to be really cinematic, so I'm adding um, strings. With a TV track, you wanted to build over time. So this is almost like a trap orchestra hybrid thing that I'm doing. And when you're playing instruments, especially something like a violin, you got to make sure that you are playing it like a violin violinist would play it. Yo. Just looking for some uh I've got a cold blood. Some vocals to make it more exciting. Yeah. Take me high. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. That's decided, right. I decided to go with this right here. Do that in simpler and just chopped it up. Uh. And that was it. That's all I took from that. Then I added some brass, a tuba. Remember the key is just to keep building up. Just making sure the low end is uh, not muddying up the mix. Alright, here we are in Ableton. I let the track sit for a little bit, you know, before I came back to it. So it has a basic arrangement on it, but um, I'm going to listen to it and see how I can add a little more um, flavor to it. Let's see what's up. This wavetable, I don't need this anymore. I'll go ahead and delete that. Kai comes in. Alright, so the strings come in, but I do need to switch up the percussion right there. Cellos.
variation right there, maybe a transition. Switching up the drums. And then a the build up right here. Splat. Okay. Maybe a few more melodies right here. This is cool, but I can I can hear some little more rhythm. Definitely we'll have another hi-hat going right about there too. Some more drops and uh, dropouts and uh, transitions. But I like all this. Double these horns. Big finale. Do 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 boom boom boom. Yeah, something like that. All right. So let's try to do all of those things I just said.